All right, hey guys, what's going on? It's Mr. Brown here, and welcome back to some more Final Fantasy VII Remake. It's been a while since we played Final Fantasy VII. Um, I just got the PS5 free version from the PS4, and now I'm about to begin the UV DLC, which I am super excited. I've been waiting for a long time to do this, so I think it's finally time to get into this and hopefully it not be terrible but uh we'll see um we're gonna play it on normal and then i'm really excited about this <clears throat> My name is Yuffie, Materia Hunter and Elite Special Forces Operative for the new Wutai government. I have orders to infiltrate Shinra headquarters and steal their ultimate materia. To prove to our common enemy that Wutai is not to be trifled with! Alright, um, so a little bit of backstory on UV if you don't know who she is from the original Final Fantasy game. She is undoubtedly the next character that you run into after you complete the Midgar portion of the uh, original game as long as as well as the Midgar portion of the remake games. She's the one that comes right after um, Red X. So this is an order. She's a material hunter. So she should be really well equipped with materia, which looks like we actually have some. Uh, we have steel, deadly dodge, healing, assess, and parry. Doesn't look like we actually have any weapons for her. Doesn't look like, okay, we do. Which has some upgrades as well. Kind of just like the original game. Um, I want that, definitely want that. Mug, that'd be a new material that wasn't in the original game. Or an ability. Uh, I'll go ahead and upgrade her HP as well. And that looks like all we could do for now. So, looks like we are starting at level 25 compared to level 7 from the original game. So, so yeah. Alright. Just confused why she doesn't like throw her. Javelin. Kind of looks like we're outside sector, uh, the Sector 7 slums, but I'm not for sure. Okay, so um, you can fight efficiently both up close and from range. Uh, press square to strike the foe by throwing her star. 
Hold square to attack. Putting distance. Okay. Okay. Oh my. Holy crap. What abilities do I have? Oh, I have a shit ton. Uh, this ability changes the elemental. So I think it goes through all the elements, and it, I don't know if it picks one at random and does like fire, ice, lightning, wind. Huh. Let's try this one. She doesn't do that much damage. Huh. Let me uh, go to the settings real quick. I want to change something. Um, I want to say it's this. Wait, what did that say? Hold on. That's, that's something that's going to be in the next game. So I think in the next game we're going to have active characters and we're going to have non-active characters. That's going to be interesting. Okay, I'm going to turn down this game, the music a little bit. It's good, don't get me wrong, but it is loud. Okay. But the game looks so good on the PS5, it's actually insane. Okay, by pressing triangle, you can hurl a weapon at a, at a target. Press square while it is away from her to perform a long range attack. I'm not, I don't know how to say ninjutsu. The weapon will return to Yuffie automatically at certain amounts of time to retrieve it sooner. Press triangle. All right. Let's see how this Holy shit! Air combat at its finest. Holy crap. This is what we needed from the last game. Okay, so Yuffie in the original Final Fantasy was not this fun to play, I'm gonna be honest. It, she was an okay character, she wasn't great, but if that's how she's gonna be in this in the remake portion of the game, this is gonna be fun. Uh, we just learned that we can press triangle to throw her. I don't know what you call it, I don't know what it's called. Ninja Star? It'd be cool if we could jump over there, that'd be nice, but it's alright. Holy cow. There is a setting that I could change. I don't know if I can do it in-game or not, but... I could change it to graphics mode instead of performance. Oh, wow. You can definitely tell that the frames are dropping a lot. Just off of having it on graphics mode, but it does look a lot better. But we're gonna turn that back to performance because that hurts my eyes. But for the picture mode, I'm sure that it comes in handy with it, so. She's already super cool. No time for small fry. What is that? Wanna for mercy? Here, let me. What does this do? Holy crap! Well, can't fault okay. him for trying. It still looks like the game's kind of holding your hand by giving you posters to follow, but let's just hope that in the original. Oh, there's a material up there. See, I think that she should be able to, like, not really, like, summon the material to her, but be able to throw her ninja star at it and kind of get it, or some other ability where she can just get it easily. So I don't have to work my way there. Huh? 
No palm. You okay? Anybody home? The hair. They didn't have hair in the original like that, I didn't think. Or in the remake. Definitely looks a lot more like Sethiroth than the other ones did. But now I'm curious of when in time we are taking, like what time and place are we taking this compared to like the remake? If it, is it after we finished? I don't think it is. I think it's like somewhere in between. Oh, wow. Guess I'm not going anywhere until I get that elevator moving. If I had to guess, it was pro it's probably around uh, maybe like chapter two-ish. I want to say, but I, I don't know that yet. We'll have to wait and see when we get to the later portions of this DLC. Um, Yeah, just by seeing him, I know it's not towards the end because I'm pretty sure most of those guys were are gone by the time we get to the Sethroth fight and the end of the remake. Oh, I should probably say spoiler alert if you haven't <laughs> finished the original or seen anything on the original. I would definitely go back and watch that or play that before you get any further in this. What does this one do? I forgot. With the power of his providence. Gotcha. That's her deadly dodge ability. Oh, it's over. All in a day's work. I can't remember if that's her uh, victory pose at the end of like when she uh when you finish a fight in the original game. I'm not sure. Hey. Oh, cheers over there. Purple is it's been a while since I played. Purple is it's not like elemental. It's like deadly dodge. That one's probably like a like an AP up maybe, or a HP up. It's probably an HP up honestly. If I had to take a guess. Yep. Damn, my good. Definitely don't play this game enough. Get that on there so we can start leveling that up. Pretty bit back there. Gotcha. I don't think we need that. Again. Oh, you can climb up ladders faster? I've seen that. Movement speed. Up. I this town's a total dump. I thought Midgar was supposed to be the marvel of the modern world. Talk about false advertising. City of Mako? <laughs> City of garbage, more like. I want to say we're outside Sector 7, but I am still not hey! sure. I can't tell. If not, we're pretty close to it. It all looks the same, honestly, but... How I'll know if if uh, where we're at kind of in the timeline from the original from the remake. I keep wanting to say the original, but from the remake is if the tower is down or not. If the tower is not down, then we're barely halfway through the game from the original. Not even halfway through. Uh, you're a little over halfway through, I guess. Huh? I gotta do something. the trick. Come on. If Throwing Star misses an object that has barred its flight path, automatically gets re okay. Down. Okay, well it says obstructive, so could have probably came up with that conclusion. So make me climb all the way to the top. There's a material over there. I'm so glad they added this stuff. That would have been super annoying if you had to go up and down the ladders. Is there a way to get over there? Yeah, I think so. No, 
Another one of these good guys. Have no fear. You be here. Oh shit. Do these are these werewolves? What are these? Oh, I have the assess material. I don't know how to use it. Wayward wolves. These were not in the remake game. I don't think. Yeah, these are not. I really would rather not get a game over in the uh, you know. This is nothing. I didn't do shit. Holy shit. Come on, get it together, Yuffie. mugging one of them. I don't think it would do anything, but it's worth a try. Just because I haven't used it yet. Oh, okay. It didn't work, but it did something. Oh, what? Uh, we shouldn't pretend like that didn't happen. Wow. Have no fear. You be here. No way. Got you now. How you like that? They just they're too fast. Should probably heal again, but we're just gonna use this. Yep. God damn it! Withers away. Be it. Okay, well, this is happening. I just, I to be honest, I don't know what to do. Let me start off with full health. I don't know if 200 is gonna matter, but let's we'll see. No hair. Oh, oh, thought he disappeared. Yeah, he has no hair. That's interesting. See, that was not that hard. I don't know why I struggled so much. Go grab this material real quick. Probably gonna be ice, fire, maybe? Wind, alright. Let's see here. Um, are we getting like. No. No, there's trophies for this, so I might have to play this a few times and do that. So, what are we getting for abilities? Because it. I don't know. Steel, no. That we dodge, okay. SS, I guess. I'm thinking about taking this off, honestly. But I don't really know what to put on it. I don't know. Oh, there's a there's a fire thingy.
I want to see if there's any loading times. You know how in the remake you'd have to like press triangle a bunch of times on doors to open them or on you got a like hold triangle to pull a lever or something like that. I want to see if there's anything like that in this now that we're on next gen console. That, that was, I really hope our stuff transfers over from my original save file from the remake because I got like like 81 million gil. I have a little under 90 hours invested in that game, so. Yeah, the plate's not even down yet. Yep, there's no way. Yeah. No. Uh. Okay, now this guy has a beard. What is his number? Six, 16. I should have checked the other guys. Sorry. <laughs> This is too weird. <laughs> okay, you got this. We're in Scrab Boulevard. Yeah, this is Scrab Boulevard. Yeah, sure is. I knew we were right outside Sector 7. Huh, okay. That Ron Nexmal's gone. Must have gotten used to it. <laughs> See. The way things are going, I'll be working for Shinra next. Nice try, Midgar. So is this gonna be before or after Cloud who went through here? He's getting to me. That's what I'm thinking. That's what I want. Where's the cave at? What did I do? Patch the cave? Yeah, it's right there, I think. That's not it's gonna be to our left right here. There was a materia in here at the yep. Same exact place. MP up. Oh, I don't know if I'm ready for this. <laughs> Wait, did you just come from any monster troubles or Monsters have been acting strange since it's not gonna be good for any since of the bombing Where are we at? Local reactor 5 has been temporarily shut down and all fires have been successfully extinguished The situation is under control and the people of our first city need not worry about any additional complications We are in the process of conducting a full forensic investigation But we suspect the device used was similar to that employed in the attack on Mako Reactor 1 Oh, oh, oh! What do we have here? <laughs> Man, that's gotta be Avalanche! Not bad. Not bad at all. But I can do better. Yuffie? <laughs> Yo. What? There's our palm! So, you're Avalanche? I'm Jija. Follow me. What? Wait up! Jija? Jihu? Chad, will you little shit? So, Jijie, why didn't you come meet me before? I figured an elite W agent could find their own way. I may be elite, but it's not like I've ever been to Midgar. And what exactly is a W anyway? Anyone who lives where you just came from, think of it as a code name. Uh huh. Still can't believe they sent a kid to do this job. Blue, what? Kid could kick your ass. Saying you're a fresh face is all. What is that? Oh, don't worry, I know exactly what you're saying. Give me a break, will ya? And let you walk all over me? So why well, they here we are. Oh my God. Ladies first. Judging from the news, they didn't get caught. They'll turn Hold up. When they do, we're gonna treat them to a feast. I can almost taste your pizza now, Jesse. Shame, since you won't be getting any. What? <laughs> okay, so we are right before... Yeah. Chapter 4, maybe? sold out everywhere. I have one base my ass. Plus this is under the thing. Oh, is there a, there's a weapon in there. Boomerang. What? Is, who are you people? Avalanche. Psst. These two are Billy Bob and Polk. 
And that's Nayo. Hi. My name is Yuffie, Materia Hunter and Elite Special Forces Operative for the new Wutai government. I have orders to infiltrate Shinra HQ and steal their ultimate materia. To prove to our common enemy that Wutai is not to be trifled with! Members of Avalanche, with your full support, we got this! <laughs> Ready to rumble, huh? You better believe it! So, did you guys meet Sonan yet? He was supposed to be here. Yeah, he got in three days ago. He's out on the town as we speak. <laughs> really seems to be enjoying it here. Oh, he does, does he? You, uh, got any bags? As if. Ninjas always travel light. It's like a rule. Huh. Oh. But I did bring these. Wu Tai's famous de chow beans. Eat up. And here you go. Uh, huh. hmm. oh. Uh, oh. Uh, and you eat these things? <laughs> Guess you do. Sheesh, you ninjas are insane. <laughs> ah. Do me a favor, Yuffie, and wait here for Sonon. I gotta head out. Your ID should be ready for pickup by now. Then why don't I join ya? Nah, I got this. Besides, you reek of trouble. <laughs> huh? Interesting. So let's equip the boomerang, because I want to use that. Oh, that looks gnarly. Uh, so it, uh... I always want to use the hunt game. Okay. And it has more materia slots, that's what I'm talking about. They have connected materia. We probably don't have a, uh... No, we don't. Probably put that on there. Okay. You look kind of nervous. I just want to make sure I have the plan down pat. You know, like how to get up top and all that. Huh. Well, if you had an ID, you'd normally just take the train up there. But with all the commotion going on, that's not really an option. Security's on high alert. If you ask me, your best bet is to sit tight and wait for things to settle down some. Sit tight? But I want to go now! Be my guest then. Go get killed. Uh, harsh. If you haven't introduced yourself to Billy Bob, you should. He's got some intel you might want to hear. Okay. <sighs> my teeth! You're welcome. So the materia I'm looking for is in the Shinra building, right? And where is that exactly? <laughs> Ignorance truly is bliss, huh? What did you just say? Oh, <laughs> didn't mean to offend you. Of course, you probably knew this already, but there's a whole other city built on the plate above us. Shinra building's right in the middle. You can't miss it. Oh, that one. Why didn't you say so? As for what to do once you make it into the building, ask Nayo. She'll give you the deets. You must be tired from your trip. Why don't you get some rest? With all the noise in this city? I'm freaking possible. How about you tell me where in the Shinra building they're keeping that materia instead? Don't hold out on me now. I know you know. Actually, I kind of don't. At least, not an exact location. All I know is that Shinra, for most purposes, treats Materia as a weapon. Which means the Advanced Weaponry Division probably deals with it. And since that's in the basement... I see... So... Shinra hides its top secret Materia in the basement. <laughs> you won't have to wait much longer, my precious. I promise. Just be careful, will you? Please? So, looks like we're heading to the basement again. So, I'm gonna leave now. Let's hey, just... you gonna be okay out there? Got all the info you need? Yes, Billy Bob. I gotta talk to you guys again? You look about ready to die of boredom. Wanna play Fort Condor? Fort 
Condor? Or a Condor. <laughs> I should have known. It hasn't been out long, so there's no way you W's would have heard of it. Uh, yes I have. And what's more, I'm awesome at it. I'll whoop you so hard you'll wonder if you ever knew the rules. For my benefit, then. Let me go over them. Oh, shit. Oh, man. Okay, for Condor is a board game where you employ units and material to destroy your opponent's headquarters before play begins. Let's select a loadout. Okay. Oh, I don't really got an option, so. Alright, I guess we're picking this one. Oh, this looks gnarly. When the game begins, both you and your opponent will each have three bases, a headquarters, and two outposts. To win the match, you must either destroy your opponent's headquarters or have more bases left standing. When the timer runs out, units will automatically march forward and engage enemies once they have been deployed. Deployment. Move the cursor to the spot you wish to deploy a unit, then press X to begin selecting the unit you want to change. The drop location, press cancel and reselect. So that looks like a... Um, let's go ahead and put down the same type of one. Magic attacks. Materia allows you to use powerful spells during a match. Press L1 to select a location to cast your magic. Once you have made your decision, press X to unleash it. To unleash the attack. Interesting. We're gonna keep. I don't have anything saved up. The dog's not going for it? What? Why? Oh no, I just... Did I cure him? Another... I don't know if that was not the one I wanted, but... Sorry. Will you attack the guy in the air? Yeah, you're not going to. Okay, you are. Okay, got his ass. Kind of like uh, Clash Royale. Is there a play that on the phone? It's pretty much that. So we got one base down. Sweet. We're gonna raid trooper, and then we're gonna select raid. Then we're gonna security officer. Should hopefully be able to take out that tower over there. Hopefully. Hope, hope, I'm hoping. Can I put troops up here? I can. Okay. I wonder if this could be like an online thing where you could go against actual people. Be the win. That was fun. Very interesting. Damn, Yuffie, how'd you do that? You totally kicked my ass. You mean you didn't lose on purpose? Wow. <laughs> well, if you're looking for a challenge, the Undercity's got no shortage of serious players. 
I've kind of got better things to do. Sure about that? Word is, if you beat the Grandmaster, you can win some serious cash. Materia, too. Materia? Hmm. That's right. But you should know, the hardcore competitors won't give you the time of day till you've proven yourself. Whatever. Bring it on! Interesting. Rank one characters. Wow. All right. You know about the VR combat simulation module, right? Huh? Yes. Uh, of course I do. Why wouldn't I? It's that thing that stimulates modulation. Hmm? <laughs> Kinda. It's a machine that puts you in a virtual world where you can practice fighting all you want. There's even a portable version of it. Guy around the corner has one. Uh-huh. Shadowy. Hardly ever see technology that cutting edge down here. So what do you say? Want to try it? I really don't have time to be playing around with some stimulator. But just to be polite, I guess I'll take it for a spin. <laughs> the guy's name is Chadley. He's over by the neighborhood watch. If you ever feel like some virtual training, I'm sure he'd be happy to help. Yay, Chadley. Someone's still not back? Must be in Walmart then. What's Walmart? Let's just say it's a place for people with mature tastes. Mature tastes. Oh, There's lots of different establishments. It's kind of hard to explain. No, I think I get it. Like bars filled with smoke so thick you can't even see. And drinks so bitter you want to spit them right back out. Um, where everyone gets drunk and complains about how kids just don't understand the value of hard work. They'll be the death of society. Ugh, how can they not see that they're the ones destroying it? <laughs> Wutai's got a place like that, where grown-ups drink their lives away. It's called the Happy Turtle. Interesting. There's a Happy Turtle in Midgar as well. Huh? I don't know where exactly, because I've never actually been, but I do see their flyers from time to time. You do, huh? Oh, I've never heard of it. taking down Midgar one citizen at a time! <laughs> I salute you, Happy Turtle. Come to think of it, there's a man who goes around putting up flyers for the bar. People call him Old Snapper. And he doesn't dress like your average Midgar male. Might be from Wutai. I gotta find him. Man deserves some da chow beans. Uh, da beans. All this talking's giving me a headache. I'm gonna go do some recon. <laughs> I won't stop you. Just don't go too far, okay? Guess I'll sleep on the bench, might as well. Alright. So Fort Condor is pretty neat. I thought when I seen the advertisements for it, like in the trailers and stuff, I thought it was gonna be a lot worse than what it actually is, but no, it's actually not that bad. Okay. You ever heard of that Fort Condor game? I'm going to the bar. I wanna see Seventh Heaven. Enough already, you can talk Shana. to Jesse. Oh my god. Get it. I should be up there with. Where are they? They should have been here by now. Hmm? Waiting for someone? Ooh, you got stood up. As if. Wait, who are you? <laughs> Don't mean to be rude or anything, kid. But do you mind? I'm not exactly in the mood. Huh, I seen that one coming. Oh well. Huh. ways are a mystery. Not that I'm Let me, uh. Okay. Um. What are these? Okay, so they've updated the map quite a bit. Okay. Spot vending machines. I think, I think we're gonna go ahead and go take on that combat simulator and see what Shadowy has us doing in this. And then we'll probably stop the video for there and then explore more of Sector 7 and the next one. Searching for candidates. Candidate detected. Performing physical analysis. She seems relatively agile and has substantial muscle mass for her stature. Hmm. 
an acceptable candidate. Hey, uh, you want to tell me what you're mumbling about? My apologies. My name is Chadley. Would you be interested in helping me with my research? I'm you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nice right. to meet you. Chadley. So, what are you researching? Combat. It would entail doing battle with the summon in a virtual arena using this portable simulator. Interested? Hmm. Sure. Why not? I'm a kick its butt. Very well then. Oh man. I didn't think we were going to do it right away. Okay, so this is a summon that is not in the remake game. This is the lightning one that we've been missing out on for a while. And I am nervous as can be. So this is difficult, and I don't have cure. Why don't I have cure? Oh, there it is. <laughs> don't do it to me. Oh, maybe I'll get to see her. Her limit break. He is very persistent. Stop it. I'm gonna die. What a shame. It was a close match. However, I did manage to obtain some invaluable data. Analyze and learn from your mistakes so that you can claim victory next time. That was went terribly wrong. Um, so lightning is weak to ice, I believe. Do I have any ice? I do. We're gonna give it a Is it ice? I wanna say it's ice. Fire, maybe? I'm gonna. Attack power, magic, attack boost, and then let's do that one. Can I do another one? I can't. Um, there we go. Let's try that. Let's try it one more time. Can if I we can't do it, then do battle with a virtual summon? we will wait till we get to play with Sauron or whatever his name is. Sauron. Because I know that eventually we'll be able to play with him. So give it one more shot. Waste this and assess him just to see if I was right. Okay, well, I really am gonna waste it. I don't like how he teleports. Oh, that's super annoying. Uh. Oh, he's on the 
Ah, I just had to touch it. I have her limit break. If I don't die first. I'm gonna die first. I need a little bit more ATB, come on. Please don't die, please don't die, please don't die, please don't die. Please don't die. Let's just use it. Bloodbath. You're not getting out of this one alive! Okay, it didn't do all of them. Okay, it did do quite a bit. Got those down. Let's heal up again. Oh, okay. shit, 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 shit. Oh, that was cool. Die to that. Yeah, if I couldn't move. <sighs> Almost had him. What a shame. It was a close match. However, I did manage to obtain some invaluable data. Analyze and learn oh. from your mistakes so that you can claim victory next time. I feel like I could beat him with just Yuffie, but I'm not going to worry about it for now. Um, actually, I want to check out the weapon store and see if there's another weapon I could buy. From this jackass from the, uh, huh? the remake. I ain't seen you around here before. Sure you're in the right store? Uh, of course, there's no weapons. Uh, probably want that one. I'll take this one for now. 4,800 gil. Jesus Christ. Sorry, I'm sure we'll get plenty of, of gill. Uh, oh, wrong one. Huh? Eh? Alright, well, I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode here. Uh, we played about 50 minutes or so of the new uh, DLC for Final Fantasy VII Remake. I thought it would be a lot quicker than this, personally. But we will continue on in the next episode. So if you guys did enjoy, please be sure to leave a like down below. And yeah, if you want to see some more Final Fantasy VII Remake, especially uh, Intermission, go ahead and subscribe for more. Um, I'm going to be hopefully pumping out the rest of these videos from the DLC here in the next couple of days or the next week or so. So yeah, if you guys did enjoy, please... Come back. I would really appreciate it. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and peace out.